morning everybody it's december 10th monday morning around 10 o'clock and this is my second video in hopefully a line of uh many videos on my youtube page that i made for the club called turf talks the reason why i made these videos and as a link that i showed you or sent to you in the last two times article for the month of december is to help explain uh, why we do what we do to educate the membership and also give you a little glimpse in the life of the superintendent as well as the maintenance staff and show you the work that goes into maintaining a golf course and trying to provide uh, the best conditions that we possibly can for you as a membership to play. Today what we are doing is a practice that I call venting greens to where I try to do it about once a month throughout the entire year and we take our little air fire um, and poke these little little tiny holes into the greens which help reduce compaction. It also helps ventilate greens and it also helps get air down into the root zone. I try to explain it, I've explained it to people in the past to where we have, uh, it's, you know, it, think of yourself sitting in a hot tub or in a bathtub for a long time. When you get out, what kind of happens to your skin? Your skin gets all pruned up and, and kind of gets all wrinkly. Um, that's exactly what happens to the roots of the plant when they're overly saturated during the winter time like this. Trying to get air down into the profile is one of the biggest things that's going to improve root health, uh, turf health overall, as well as trying to pro pro provide a firm surface as much as we possibly can throughout the winter. This is the depth of the holes that we are punching today. We're going about three inches, um, which is about the depth that we have found to, uh, without reducing or without creating the heaving that is going to you know, it's going to impact the quality of the ball roll of the entire green. Come over here with me and check out the cup that we just cut. You'll be able to see by punching these little small holes how much fracturing and how much breaking up of the surface inside this hole is creating. You can see right around the edge here, these are all kind of small air, small holes that are being punched, and you can see how much disturbance is made inside of where this cup is. This is what's going to help go ahead and, and help drain. Uh, the surface is going to help kind of move water down into the profile, which in, to you guys will help create a better plain surface and overall turf health for the entire green. Our goal is to try to punch all these greens in one day, but we do try to come out and, and weather pending, we will try to do as much as we possibly can. But again, we try to do this about once a month. Some of our problem greens, 17, 18, number one, uh, we try to do maybe a little more than that. So. In an ideal world, I would love to throw some sand on top of this, but considering how wet things have been over the last week, I would actually do more damage than good by throwing some sand and top dressing the greens on top of these little holes. So I hope that this kind of helps uh, explain why we do what we do, and uh, you'll see some more videos coming from me in the future. I appreciate it. Thank you.